这里是我的故乡，我出生在这里，是一九三五年七月生，家里有爷爷奶奶、爸爸妈妈、哥哥、姐姐、嫂嫂，一个姐姐死了，还一个姐姐到养人当了个，找我，我们是最小。是我们苦个，我一直不过开呢。我到杭州去做保姆，呃，他个小鸡啊，送到学校里头，学校给读书。上幼儿园就是我在外面唱舞听，啊，听听呢，我是本来是没有文化的啊，也有了点文化。我到解放军就是回来，警察工在当，去搞革命。呃，噶许多个老古大众嘞，还没得发一声鼓。我要帮助噶菜地，啊，白天呢读书，晚上呢，呃，写字，写字当个政策，写写字呃，毛主席啊，这个个呃，帮啊呃，自己当家，啊，分得土地啊。哎，俺狗屋呢，本来有八个的。没分到手的，我七十五岁房子分进我，我多困苦的，刚刚年年我个啊，哟，年龄轻呢，怎么哎，这这这个个老母没得做噻，刚刚个儿子毛主席就八十三岁，就我广东两个毛主席做出来刚刚八十三个，可就啊这个就是这样。Sunday afternoon with George. George was late husband. He's deceased now for two years. Because when I married George back in 1957, he was an orchardist. So six o'clock, he's up. Well, we're both up. Work till seven. I'd come in, do breakfast. He'd come back in, have breakfast. Work till one o'clock, and. Then either if somebody came to us in food season time, we still stopped and had our afternoon tea and had had our nice relaxing time. Family relations, friends, anybody. The women would get together and they had their, I suppose the men would say gossip session. The men and in the Dalmatian culture, wine and water is just like a cordial. George and I did everything together, so I think when we. Think about the Sunday afternoons. I do anyway. It's so precious. It's I miss George, and I just will not forget how nice it was on those relaxing Sunday afternoons for when you work Sunday morning, and then afternoon arrives, and you know you're going to have this nice relaxing time, and it just gears you up for the rest of the thing. So Sunday afternoons have really are very memorable to me, and will stick with me all the time.